Okay. Yes, viewers all around the world, thank you once again for joining us here. We are here at the other side of Guludi area in Malawi, where the earthquake that occurred a few months ago, you can see right there from the mountain, you can see from the mountain right there, that is where this strange flood was coming from and nobody knew where the water was actually coming from and it came down and swept all the people at this community as we are speaking right now we don't even know if we are actually standing on top of people right now viewers all over the world i just want you to observe a minute of silence to those who have lost their loved ones just a minute of silence because i believe that a lot happened here on that fateful day on the 3rd of march around 5 a.m in the morning and by the grace of god i want you to please join me as we observe a minute of silence to those who have lost their loved ones their homes may the mercy of god continue to speak for them and for those who love their lost one may christ jesus comfort them in the name of jesus christ i have a brother here who is part of the community leader who wants to explain what happened on that faithful day on the 3rd of march 2023 right here in guludi community in malawi brother you are very much welcome can you speak to our viewers your name shortly what happened that fateful day around 5 a.m in the morning when everyone was sleeping all right uh, my name is Zeri as well as i'm actually one of the victims here what happened was like people were in a deep sleep that was the 14th of march and they, they just heard something like a, a sound of a commotion therefore they were asking each other what is it but they, without the, any answer they just you realize that they have been carried away by the water hmm. the water was actually coming from a mountain on top there mixing with a, uh, the stone you from see you mean from that mountain yes. there the water was actually just coming. can you show us the mountain which one are you talking about that one that mountain yes. water was coming from the top yes it was coming from the top mixed with the stones mixed with stone stones muddy wow and oh, different okay. Tree from the, that particular can you show place. us can you just walk down there let's see yes. viewers all over the world you can see the place where her brother um is actually talking of he said this strange flood happened around 5 a.m in the morning when people were sleeping and the flood came right there from the mountain you can see and then swept the whole community you can see you can see you can see you can see down there even up till now many are still missing and lives you know lives have been lost yes. and you know he is one of the victims like he said he said he's actually one of the survivors of this cyclone earthquake that happened on the third 13th of march viewers all over the world we are using this medium to cry out to you please reach out to these people we are actually in Guludi community here in Malawi. And I know there are other communities who are also badly affected by this cycling earthquake. But I'm not really saying you must only help people of this community. Please reach out to these people. We are calling on the United Nations at this point in time to please, these people need a shelter. They need somewhere, you know, that people can just lay their hands their heads at the moment please we are calling all our family friends partners all around the world to please remember these people remember them in prayer remember them with all the resources that god has given to you once again you can see that mountain over there you know here you can you are seeing right now where buildings houses families and then that fateful day on the 13th of march 2023 around 5 a.m in the morning there was a strange noise as he said he said there was a strange noise and before they know it this strange flood came from nowhere and swept the whole community away right now lives have been lost many are still missing many are unaccounted for and then we believe that maybe many people are still trapped right now in the rubble we pray that their soul rest in perfect place in jesus name Thank brother you. we 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 share your pain and we believe that viewers listening to you right now they are also you know thinking of what they would do to help all of you in this community you are not alone in this battle Thank you. 
you people are not alone more helps are coming this is the beginning this is the beginning of the new thing the lord is about to do in your life you know sometimes god use foolish things like this kind of situation to bring his goodness to bring his glory to our life and i want to believe that this foolish situation is making this community known to the whole world guludi community here in malawi we are live here in guludi community i'm not saying only guludi needs help but please try to reach out to most of this community in malawi who needs this wonderful gift that god has put in your hands let us spread the joy of resurrection to the entire world and as to do so god will meet you at the point of your need in jesus name. we have uh our our uh, our elder here uh mr nsuya he also wants to share something that happened he's also one of the malawians here who can also tell you what happened that fateful day on the 13th of march 2023 can you tell us what Brethren, happened? out there it was such a fateful uh, morning. People wake up and they just realize that they're in trouble. Hmm. As the prophetess has said, there was a terrible eruption from the mountain. A huge amount of water came with rocks. They rolled down and uh, you know, swept away houses in this community. Lives were lost, property was lost, uh, uh, crops were lost also livestock we are lost mm. and these people are desperately looking for your help mm. we are praying that uh, god is going to give you the grace to help the bible says it's more blessed to give than to receive if you bless these people god is going to remember you amen. in jesus christ might name amen. amen 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 viewers all over the world anywhere you are at this moment we want you to remember the people of guludi community please please these people need your help Amen. there are many of them who does not even have anywhere to lay their heads at this moment people yes. need help people need help please reach out to them at this moment we want to plead to the united nation please at this point in time let us reach out to this community they need something to lay their hands we have come with what god has put in our heart to give and i strongly believe that god that is infinite mercy will open more doors to organization, government, offices, corporate office, corporate business to come into the aid of these people and help them. Please, we need your help at this moment. We yes. need what you have for these people's survivor. Please, we know that we are together in this battle. Please Amen. reach out to these people. Amen. I'm not saying you should, you should send their money to me. Please, no. Please reach out to them reach out to these people there are a lot of ways we can do it please reach out to these people they need your help we've actually been driving for the past seven hours from lilongwe just to reach these people at this time and finally we are here i'm humbled to be to be seeing this historical place that this incident happened on the 13th of march 2023 and i know that god is a comforter he will comfort them yes you know i'm imagine that i'm standing right now you know we don't know what happened but i believe that you know god knows the best but people all over the world as you've listened to one of our elder in glorious light international church and you've also listened to one of the victims as well one of the survivor who spoke about what happened that very day please reach out to these people please reach out we're begging you please reach out and as you do so god will touch you god will revive your life as well God will restore your life as well. God will renew your life as well. God will save you as well. As you save others, God will save you from that difficulty, from that challenges, from that pain. God will save you also in Jesus' name. We love you, brethren. Shalom in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise Amen. God.